What's going on guys? Me Bruce here, back from Lego video. And today, I have these four uh, sets of four base plates, which these are the old Lego road plates, uh, which now unfortunately are retired. Uh, but these are knockoff ones uh, from Timu. And each one of these packs uh, inside, it is every single road plate that Lego is made in this style. So you have the T, uh, and then you can see there's the curve, uh, and there's a four-way and a regular straight. So in this pack, uh, you get all four of them, and Timu was selling these for about $11 a piece. So I got four of them uh, because most of my vehicles would not fit on that new style of road plate, which is unfortunate because I did buy three packs of the new Lego road plate. Probably bought more than that. Uh, so I'm buying these now because most of my vehicles will not fit on them. These six wide vehicles will just about fit in these lanes. It is meant for six wide vehicles, uh, but the new road plates are only for four wide vehicles like Jaden's old car. And that still fits in here. Uh, it is a bigger lane. But, like you just saw, a six-wide vehicle would not fit in here. Uh, so, these are 32x32 32 32 base plates, and not the regular 16x16 16 16 base plates. Uh, so, I'm just going to open one of these packages up. They did get damaged a little bit. So, this is going to be a quick little review on these base plates. All right, so they don't feel too bad. Uh, you get this cross, this fork in the road, T. You get a straight plate, a four-way cross, and then a curve. Uh, so the idea is that you can just arrange these however you want. Out. You can just arrange these however you want. Let's. It'll probably be better if I just do that. You can just arrange these in any orientation that you want. And you do get a six stud wide uh, sidewalk. So you can just combine these and use them. And I feel like Lego should have kept this design instead of going with the newer design. But that's just my opinion. Uh, so this was actually a lot cheaper than buying all of these officially made by Lego. Uh, so if you're on a short but on a tight budget, I mean, these are a good option, in my opinion. Not really sure the compatibility with these, but they seem to work pretty well. This is an official Lego brick, and they connect pretty well together. Uh, so yeah, if you're on tight budget, or if you want these plates and don't have the money to buy the official ones, I'd say go for it. It's worth it. Takes a little bit to get to you, uh, depending on where you live. But overall, I think it's good. So uh, the other three packs, including this one, are going to go towards stop motion, specifically ones in LEGO City, because obviously Star Wars doesn't have these style of roads. But who knows, maybe I can use these plates in a Star Wars stop motion or mock. Uh, I will try, and yeah, you guys will see that for sure on this channel, if I do, 
or on my Instagram or TikTok. So you guys will definitely see if I do anything because those are the only three places that I currently post. So you won't miss out as long as you check those. And I'm not trying to self-promote here. I'm just letting you know that if I were to do something, it will be posted on at least one of those. So yeah, without further ado, my conclusion is that if you're on a tight budget or if you just want road plates and you really don't care, this is a decent option. Uh, but if you are a purist, a Lego purist, then you can get the uh, regular on-brand Lego base plates. I'm not going to stop you. Just letting you know that this option is out there for cheaper. And not sure if and when these will retire, but the Lego ones are retired, which makes the price skyrocket. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video, and especially for making it to this part of the video. If you enjoyed, I would greatly appreciate it if you could leave a like, comment down below what your thoughts, and if you are going to be picking these up, I will do my very best to leave a link down in the description. Uh, but occasionally on Timu, when you buy something, they immediately remove the listing. So it might not be there, but I'm going to do my very best to put it there. And yeah, that'll do it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed. It's a lot of fun to make. And stay tuned for the stop motions that it will be featured in all four of these packs. So yeah, may the force be with you. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.